Yo, what's going on, guys? Uh, I'm gonna answer this question now. Uh, there's actually no one an no one asked in the last hour a question on my last story, uh, even though I asked on live. So what I'm gonna do is I went on Google and I searched up the most common questions in fitness. And I'm just gonna like fire them out. I'm not gonna take a long time on each of them. Maybe like if people are watching on the replay, if you're watching this on replay, let me know. <clears throat> Obviously, if you're watching live, you'll get all of it right now, but. I'm going to probably if one question is like more intriguing to you, uh, just comment down below and then I'll do a longer version of that on YouTube. So the first uh, question is what is the best way to lose fat? What is the best way to lose fat? Um, this question is probably the most obviously asked question. A lot of people want to know how to lose fat and my simple answer to that is there's three, three steps or three you know keys. Nutrition obviously cardio and uh you know weight training conditioning you know weight training um if you do those three things every day five times a week three times a week intensely you're gonna lose fat if you you know focus on your nutrition if you're able to eat you know at a calorie deficit as you probably hear all the time which pretty much means whatever um you know your body burns naturally you just have to eat 250 300 to 500 calories less than that, what you burn in a day, and you're gonna lose weight eventually, if you consistently do that. Um, if I lift weights, will I get bigger muscles? Yes. Uh, if you lift, now there's a two part question to this, but um, if you lift weights that are challenging to your muscles, you will grow bigger muscles. So the way like muscle, you know, building muscle works, is when you're working out, you're actually not building any muscle. When you're working out, you're tearing it down. So when you're, when you're working out, when you're doing curls, when you're doing chest press, when you're doing lunges, squats, you're actually breaking those muscle fibers, you're breaking them up, which is why you get a pump, because all the blood is flowing there to recover. Um, so what you, but yes, long story short, if you want to break muscles, you're going to build on top of them and then they're going to grow. So yes, you have to lift weights or do some sort of intense uh, calisthenics, push-ups, pull-ups, box jumps. You don't necessarily need weights to grow muscles, but if you lift weights, you will grow muscles. Uh, number three, how do I get a flat stomach? Pretty much the same thing as the first question. Um, how do you get a flat stomach, which is pretty much, you know, you eat right, you do cardio, and you weight, lift weights. Um, lifting weights, you know, is probably not as important for just a flat stomach. Cardio and uh, nutrition will be. Number four, should I do cardio first or weight training first? Now this is a big one. This is a big one, all right? Uh, I believe you should do both at the same time. Let me explain. I look at fitness as a circle, you know, or you can look at it as a triangle, whatever, it doesn't fucking matter. Um, but you, you need certain pillars in order for you to be like the healthiest version of yourself, right? Number one, like I always say, is the nutrition. If you're not eating right, you're not gonna be able to be the best version of yourself. You have to eat right. Number two is you have to lift weights. And number three is you gotta do some sort of cardio, um, endurance training. And so what I believe, I think you should do cardio and weight training at the same time. I don't think you should just start one or you know, do the other one. Do them both at the same time, and it's gonna get better results. Because as you build muscle, your metabolism increases. And as you do cardio, you're burning more calories. So it's just gonna be, um, you're gonna get results faster doing that, you're gonna get results quicker. Um, by doing cardio and weights. I think people uh, think when they do weights first that they're just gonna like bulk and like get big, which is true if that's like your goal and that's what you're intending to do. But if you're a beginner, like if you're just starting out and you you know haven't got a gym membership yet, and you haven't worked out in a couple years, a couple months, whatever, doing both is not gonna get you big. If you're doing cardio and weight training, you're gonna lose. Um, so that's what I'd recommend doing is do them both at the same time. Um, if you're going to choose one of them, I would, if you're brand new, choose cardio, like get your body moving, you know, uh, weight training can be kind of confusing. So start with cardio. And if you're going to like a, uh, a big box gym, this is my little Malik's fit tip for you. Uh, if you're new to the gym and you don't know how to lift weights and you're intimidated, just go sign up for a gym, walk on the treadmill and just watch what people are doing. <laughs> like literally just watch what people are doing. And then in a week, two weeks, you'll be like, all right, like I liked how she did that or I liked how he did that, I'm gonna do that. And so just <clears throat> build your confidence that way. 
but highly recommend doing both uh, all in all. Number five, do I need to take dietary supplements? What do you think? Do you think you need to take dietary supplements? Saberga, um, no, you don't. You do not need to take dietary supplements. It is a supplement. It will supplement your good diet, your good training, your good, um, you know, whatever program you're on. It will supplement it, but it will not uh, be the end all be all to your results. There's been times where, you know, I've taken supplements. There's been times where I haven't. You know, sometimes when I don't, I see the same results of when I do. Do I take supplements right now? Yes, I do. Um, I take, I don't take anything like super drastic, like, C24, you know, muscle, you know, size pill or whatever. But I take a, a multivitamin in the morning. I take a, uh, these are all the ones I take in the morning. Multivitamin, fish oil, magnesium, B12, L-glutamine if I have it. L-glutamine will help with uh, muscle recovery. And then um, I sometimes take uh, extra vitamin C, like in a little emergency packet, just depending on how I'm feeling to get me up. I'll probably take that like two, three times a week. So do you need dietary supplements? Absolutely not. Number six, which is the last one, what is my target heart rate? Um, your target heart rate is gonna be you know, totally custom to you. Um, I would say a target heart rate, you know, if you're, like let's say you work in the office, this is gonna be different. My, my hot water is gone, I'm about to go get that real quick. Hold on, this is the, the beauty of lives. The beauty of lives. Um, what is your target heart rate? If you're like working at an office or you're you know sitting down a lot, you're not doing a lot of activity, um, and you're just getting into fitness and health, I would say your target heart rate would probably be, uh, I would say about 60. I'm gonna double check that just because I have a computer right here. Um, target heart rate, um, just because, why not, right? So yeah, so 55 to 85, so 60 is pretty close. Um, 55 to 85, so I would say again, if you're a sedentary person, you don't work out much, you know, you eat junk food and you're just getting into your fitness, um, your health journey, then I would say anywhere from 80, 70 to 85 is a good resting heart rate. If you're an active, you know, someone who works out very often, you work out three, four, five times a week, um, your sedentary, your uh, heart rate, your like, you know, resting heart rate should probably be around 55 to 70. Um, that should be your, your target heart rate. So, and then let's look up target heart rates for fat loss. Google, love Google. So on my fitness pal, my fitness pal obviously, uh, is a credible source. It was bought up by Under Armour. They have a lot of, if you don't have my fitness pal, you don't track your food, highly recommend that. But they say, um, you know, if you're trying to burn fat, then your heart rate should be, you know, this is the, the formula, what they say, 220. All right, 220 minus your age. So whatever your age is, uh, you know, subtract that from 220 and that should determine your, your fat burning zone, um, what they call it. So it's about 60 to 70% of your max heart rate. And uh, yeah, so that's, that's the heart rate question. But those are all the questions. Uh, if you're just getting on, um, I used, uh, I just answered like five questions um, before this. These are the questions that I asked or that I answered. Um, they were the top fitness questions. What is the best way to lose fat? If I lift weights, will I get bigger muscles? How do I get a flat stomach? Should I do cardio or weight training first? What is my target heart rate? And do I need dietary supplements? So those are the questions I just answered. Um, again, if you want your question answered, asking the question, go on my last story and just plop it in the question box, whatever, whatever it's called. And I'll answer my, my next live. I was going to answer it this live, but I did not get any, um, any questions from you guys, unfortunately. I think it was just too soon. It was Sunday. I think people are doing stuff. Errands. I was doing errands. So everyone's probably, it's like errand time for the, for people. So no worries. Hopefully you got some value from this. Angela, I will definitely save this video. Uh, I think it's going to help a lot of people, especially if I can um, put it up on YouTube or something. But again, six questions if you're just coming on. What is the best way to lose fat? If I lift weights, will I get bigger muscle? How do I get a flat stomach? Should I do cardio first or weight training first? Do I need dietary supplements? And what is my target heart rate? Those are the questions I answered. Hopefully you guys liked them. If you did, uh, hit the likes. I'm about to end this so the likes don't really matter. But um, if anyone's still on here, I will answer one more, a little bonus question. If you guys have a bonus question um, that weren't in those six. Um, I'm gonna go actually make my coffee. I will come back. And if I see a question, I'll answer it. If not, I'll end it. So if you're watching this on replay, um, hit the replay button or comment down saying replay so I know how many people are watching on replay. And I will be back in like two seconds. Making my coffee, cause I love coffee. I'm addicted to coffee. Oh, coffee. I like coffee. It tastes so good. Coffee. Oh, 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 o
coming back. All right, so no questions. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed that. Uh, love you guys. Love whoever uh, stayed till this part of the video. Uh, again, if you have any questions, shoot me a DM. Appreciate you all. Love you.